Welcome, guys. So first card is free, and that's kind of dumb and scary. And it reminds us of the worst card ever print, a legendary ever printed, Aviana, unplayable card. All right. Honestly, I have no idea what to do about this. It's not like I have a lot of big good cards. Probably have to just pick Death Knight and stuff. But before I build a deck or do anything, we have to evaluate standard and laugh at how terrible it is. Even after nerfs. Because that's... I mean buffs. We don't get nerfs anymore, guys. We get buffs. Let's just play the dragon deck. It's a little bit more fun than paladin nonsense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The only thing that happened is Paladin did not get nerfs. Which is questionable, right? I mean, the Divine Shields also protect Paladin from getting nerfs, which is completely natural and totally expected. That's what Divine Shields do. I mean, it's, it's so stupid. Nothing really changed. Like, Death Knight did not just fell off. And Paladin was not even touched, so what was the point? To buff a bunch of cards? Because it felt safe to do that? It's, it's fucking stupid, like, it, you first nerf everything, and then uh, emerging strategies show up. And then you buff... You first nerf, then you can start buffing cards. But they're just basically trying new things all the time, just like I do in Hearthstone. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing for the seventh year in a row or something. I never know what the hell I'm doing in this game. The only thing I'm doing is hating on Borklers and stuff. <sighs> Alright. So that comes down into that. This thing got changed. Mm-hmm. So, uh, let's pull up evaluations. Card rules. So you guys know what's up. I'm no longer gonna care if I don't interact for three turns in a negative way, simply because it's too complicated to do that. So who cares? I'm not gonna get offended. It would be nice to be able to do something right now. I can just play it next turn. Best bet is honestly playing a taunt. But he gets to interact with it. Good enough for me, but you just got that card for free. So far, you know, I can't actually interact, so I probably would have uh, removed a point. Yeah, I don't have much more than that. This dies, I get to Vizier, but. I'm, I'm pissed, man. Like, for fuck's sake. This should be nerfed as well. Ah, oh, fuck me. It's not like they, like, don't have enough of these cards, right? And they have to discover them constantly. No, they're just, like, ridiculously good cards. And just because I have three runes, guys, you forced to have three runes anyways. You forced. But I have three of the same color. 
Oh, wow. We don't mix and match, actually, runes. You, you do have the same of three color. So you get to have broken cards now? I don't understand. I don't understand why they came up with rune system besides, like, oh, I, I, they have brain damage and they need to be healed from brain, brain damage. But this is a running gag now. I'm tired. There's no healers, guys. No one gives a around here, all right? No one even knows! Like, they're so far off in their insanity. I mean, you would get buffs, nerfs. You don't. You wouldn't give a fuck. You got something out of Blizzard very quickly, and it didn't do anything. <sighs> Just because you see five classes, which is a a normal thing to do, but like th these classes were not healed, and Mage was not even really touched that much at all, even though it just fell off recently. Which is kind of cute. I like Mage not existing. But uh, there's another Borkler Master. On top of the leaderboard. Where literally the win condition is playing Borklers. That's the win condition. You have to draw a Borkler and play it. I am so impressed. By your win condition. I can actually silence this. Which is so cute. If I need like super duper tempo. But now I just need meme status, so let's do it. I'm so stupid. Well let's let's go away out of embarrassment. But you're not gonna fuck me in the ass, bro. You're not gonna catch me being embarrassed. Against your stupid emotes. I mean, uh, one thing I can tell you guys. Whatever you think life is about, you're wrong. Wow, you're so cool and friendly. You saw something you shouldn't see, bro. What is he gonna do now? I had two choices. My brain, my brain did not pick this card. I, I never played this combination of things before. Like I clearly don't know what the fuck I'm doing. By the way, wind smoke is a is a thing on YouTube. Well, either he's writing a book or doesn't exist. Yeah, I mean, that's how you have to read. Choose one, it's gonna be on the, the left side if it starts with the silence. That is very convenient. So far, no, no nothing happened for 40, 400 seconds. Looking 1500. It's just gonna go all in, I guess. No questions asked. I could, like, steal with Sylvanas. I have a way to juice her up. He has a full hand, though. He might str Okay. I'll just go now. He cleared my board in one turn, guys. I love the file. I love the file as much as Raron is. Oh wait, I I don't like Raron anymore, for loving the file. So, honestly, anytime they fucking say something, in my brain, you get burned a little bit. Don't worry about it. It doesn't hurt. For what? What did you get? He's gonna have to share what he got from me. A new song begins. He got woken up from his sleep. 
Oh, th th there's more to life than just trying to win. This is not a Borkler class, am I right? It's uh, the freeze one. I could keep a uh, silence, but I I'm I'm addicted now. Smashing him in the face. It doesn't even do shit. As you can see, I've made the same opening many times. Doesn't even bother. There you go. I honestly don't know what the fuck he's talking about, so... What? Blood? What is happening? A tiny blood deck? Not 40 cards? So you can cram in more Borklers. Fuck my life, bro. Just flexing on me. I can clear your board from whatever, and whenever, and however. Son of a fucking bitch, man. Alright. Well, there's... You can only do it with that one card. That's interesting. See, we have a new YouTube creator now. This is so stupid. So that's how you get more Borklers? That was fun. I'm not gonna play against the fucking Borkler master. The master of all Borklers. This is- I, I, I don't wanna fucking do this shit. And it's like, oh, nerves, guys, so you're gonna get four of them. And they're not gonna do shit. And Paladin does not actually exist, guys. Have you heard? There's no Paladin. We only care about top 1,000 Legend players and stuff, alright? Where they discover a lot of things, guys. Right? It's my favorite thing. How could I pre how could have predicted that, guys? That nothing would happen. Cuz I've sort of eluded but like I'm, I'm not doubling down on anything. Cuz I'm not a terrible person, but like at this point like Blizzard is only going to do this and I'm going to do this. And it's like that's our relationship right now. And sometimes I'm going to say something and this will happen. It's like, wow, that was funny. Let me guess, you're gonna play spells and then win. It's my favorite strategy. I should juice it up, but it's it's a tough one. Like 
Like, I can show you how quickly you can get tired of this game when you fucking... When your brain works. Obviously, the most annoying part is uh, realizing that you can't communicate with people. What do I mean by that? They're so fixated on, like, I'm playing a game. I'm trying to win. There's just, like, a few things they're fixated on. And it's like, yeah, you're just doing what the NPCs are doing. <laughs> Tell me more about it. Oh, you don't have an opinion because you're an NPC. Oh, wow. So, of course, it's hard to talk to people if they don't have anything to say. Just repeat some bullshit that other people believe in. Or they think other people believe in it's it gets it gets so much worse. It could just be be a belief about belief. Because you've seen so many people do the same thing. And then it becomes a self fulfilled prophecy where no one's actually playing for fun. Even like Raron who uh, who makes like fun videos and stuff. And now he's on top of YouTube food chain. Nah, he's just, you know, he's just memeing around. The moment there's a tavern brawl, he will try to fucking win. Uh, he actually, like, touched. Guys, he touched Pogo Hopper in the middle of the tavern brawl that was last week. He touched the Pogo... He's dirty now. His hands is filled with blood and gore. Like, I can't look at this guy straight anymore. So that's cool. Oh, you play spells, mage! Oh, my, where's your bar players? When I build a, a mage deck, I had to add every single bar player I could find. And you didn't, because you're a piece of shit. Look at that. Wow. Did we... Had interactions? I think I killed, like, two mechs, guys. I don't remember killing three, though. So I guess that didn't work out. But we're gonna get stars. A star rating. Almost. I'm so excited, guys. I have this sound effect. He lost all hope, guys. Oh, I don't get to punch you in the face? Fantastic. One, two, three. I, I, like, I can't rate this game higher than this. Three! His strategy was to lose. You have to play tempo and that stupid light show is supposed to be, like, against... Just to push more damage in. Because it's literally four damage to the face, six damage to the face. Like, are you that stupid? You're just gonna win with that one card, right? What the fuck is wrong with you? This is why mage is so low, because they don't fucking know how to build the deck properly or play the deck. And fucking... yeah. Do, do mages need buffs? Maybe. But they need more nerfs. So you can actually play tempo for ones! Oh my god, guys. All right, let's go uh, against the uh, the biggest outlaw in the game. Let's go. Oh yeah, I forgot. That. Yeah, you're right, Rebecca. Nah, 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 nah. He he still has some guts to fucking. Mulligan, congratulations. Congratulations, he did it, guys. Fuck this shit, man. And you... This should be nerfed. Nerf this! Wasting my time. Nerf it. For fuck's sake. When you're learning about the game, and you're, like, scrambling between cards, and you don't know what the fuck you're doing, that's cool! You can waste my time. I can read and appreciate art and stuff that I didn't see. But now that I'm a master of this game, 
You're gonna fucking waste my time. You really gonna do that? You really gonna poop in front of entire audience? Oh my god, bro. Entire audience of two people and stuff. Jesus Christ, the, you, you guys getting disrespected. No wonder nobody wants to subscribe to me. Holy shit. But, like, you can say I'm negative, right? But I'm the only one! Does, does that... <laughs> Does that make it bad as well? Uh... Well, I guess you... I guess I have to add another word. Diversity phobe. Because the actual diversity of is out of personality. And, uh, honestly, it's a cookie jar of, of words. There you go. Negative transphobe. T tell me more, my friends. Tell me more. I will definitely fix that problem that you're talking about. I don't have an undead or will have it anytime soon, but I have this taunt master that will just break his bones. While he tries to jump over this wall. Mark of the Walls. The only question is, do I do Seedman first? I have to defend myself against this nonsense. And the moment the wall is broken, I can do Aquatic for- <gasps> Oh, but- Fucking hell. I started burping, guys. <laughs> There we go. Who created this? Oh, this guy. Now this is like an average card. Average 3-drop. It's not like it's a 4-4, four four, right? It's... Eh, eh, pfft, Divine Shield? Nah, bro. Nah, it's completely normal. We never had to nerf that card. There was never a Smooth Brain Paladin deck in the game. Uh, so he's unable atta to attack as well as I am. Let's uh, let's do one of these. I could have summoned, but I only have one chance, right? Eh, this fine. All right, let's see what he has. He has to attack with all of them. Break your bones, my friend. Let's go! The menagerie, the menagerie! Let's draw four cards! If only I could do that. But it's a pure paladin. We can't touch pureness. We can't nerf that. The buffs are gonna do everything. Obviously, we don't know until people build and test decks and counter, and we don't know how this actually looks like, but for fuck's sake. Please change my mind. Yes, buffs will save the game, as if that's how it works. There's a lot more w bad cards in the game than there are good cards, which is why nerfs work. If you want to do buffs, you have to almost like completely redesign the way the card works. Or something. Maybe I'm exaggerating, but like... Like Light Ray, maybe? <laughs> okay, Light Ray is, is a nerfable card. I mean, I'll craft more ideas, guys. I don't have to panic. I'll just have to silence whatever the fuck he's doing here. I think it's okay to swarm myself. I ran out of cards. I'm not a pure druid deck, so I can't draw 
as many cards as I want, so. The, the, the funniest thing is, like, uh, again, Blizzard's mindset is like, oh, if you restrict yourself and you play these specific cards or a specific deck type, which is like the weirdest thing, you get crazy ass bonuses on top of that. And then it's like, but what about deck building? You just want to remove that from existing? There's going to be no deck building anymore? Like, he actually comboed this shit out. It's, it's that easy. And now he wins with that combo. Like, good old days, boys. 6-4 with Divine Shield. So what the fuck? <laughs> okay. 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 So, uh, yeah. Uh, that's, uh, that's all the time I have for standard, and it really looking good. I mean, did we do trades? I forgot, guys. Did we do interactions? I'll pull... <laughs> I have to reevaluate one more time because this is so weird. I got lost in my own fucking thoughts. I'm not gonna take footage of this anymore though. The problem is like I'm so riled up. I I, I can't even pay attention whether I'm making trades or not. Whether there's a three Three minions on the board that I could trade with. I don't even pay attention to that. This is how pissed off I am. One more death. But if it if it gets confirmed, then that's the evaluation. Like f f I'll I'll gonna add both of them in. If that's the evaluation, if it's actually accurate, double or nothing, boys. I definitely want to build a druid deck so i could play shrub for free guys but they don't have big things like the big spells are useless i don't know if it's wild or not in the tavern usually it's wild cards i don't know you have to have a very big collection for stuff like that i couldn't even like activate my dragon card properly Like, actually, this would be a, an interaction. Especially if I do this. Then we kill the... Wait. We can kill everything. Damn, bro. Well, he ran out of cards. And I have a perfect way to overwhelm him. I just need to get the seven mana though. I would prefer eight mana. I would prefer having cards. There we go. I mean, Scorch is not supposed to get nerfed or anything. It's a perfectly fine 40 points of tempo for 9 mana, guys. And serve your king. It's not like I will get to 9 mana anytime soon. I do have upgraded hero power, it's just not helpful at all. I could play this on turn 9, but we have a turn 9, so... It's all... It's all figured out already. Alright. Never mind, I, I just lost. to play one of these that's cute 
but it blocks me from... Well, let's do this instead. I can't play the fucking dragon anymore. Too much pressure. Oh, fuck my life. Yeah, discover effects were the problem. I knew it. It that was the problem. I forgot. Everything's fixed now, guys. Watch him find lethal. It it can't happen, but I just need to survive till this godforsaken moment. I should be able to, come on man. I have my hero power and everything. The only question is, do we generate a taunt or not with the zombie shit? <sighs> do we actually... We killed like three creatures. Of course. Can't win them all. Oh my god. I mean the evaluation not not too bad at one hundred, right? I should, though, reduce the evaluation. If I have cards in my hand, if I have a full hand and I still fucking lose, like, there's something fucking wrong with the game. I'm not supposed to have that many resources. But e even that's a stretch, man. It's so fucking stupid. Because I'm thinking about Elder Scrolls Legends and the rune system is terrible. But drawing cards is kind of cute, because you get more resources. But if you can't play those resources, what was the point? So even their rune system is shit. The best way to fix it is actually reduce the cost based on your fucking health. It's the easiest thing, and it would change the way the game works for the better. Yes, the games would be longer. But at least you get to play your cards. You just have to nerf card draw, that's it. And the, the game would be fixed all of a sudden. Because now you have to think whether you want to use value uh, with, with your cards or you just uh, rush them out of your hand. Right now, you don't have to think about that anymore. There's none of that happening. You just, if you run out of cards, then your deck sucks. It never happens. It's not supposed to happen anymore. Your deck sucks, bro. If you run out of cards, just add bigger, bigger cards. They're going to do the same exact thing as the small ones anyways, bro. It's like, even sometimes even better. Bigger cards are sometimes even better than the small cards. Oh my fucking God. So the only fucking answer to the big cards is like a removal, right? Like the game is so degenerate now. I can't understand anything. What the fuck is happening? I'm trying to explain and it's like fucking my brain stops functioning. Did he generate it? He, he literally just plays that unironically. Just add bigger cards that do things. Well, Druid doesn't have some stuff like that. I can play my dragon. I, I'm dying on the board before I play a dragon despite playing tempo. What is happening? What the fuck is happening? How do you play a 5-mana 10-10? Just because I have corpses! EVERYONE HAS CORPSES! What the fuck is happening? Guys, if you... If you draw 5 cards, you can summon a 3-mana 7-7! Seven, seven. Who? How many? 5 cards? In a turn? No, just draw 5 cards, guys. That's how every single Blizzard card should work from now on. That's the actual power creep. 
some stupid ass condition that anyone can do, call it a new class or whatever, and it's like, wow, that was easy. I can do that, guys. I will only win because this guy is playing fucking memes against me. Like, legit insane. I think he had a divine shield, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That works. That works. Look at the memes. You gotta appreciate the memes, man. That's useful. I'll take that. The level of frustration I have, but it gets beyond the fucking point. Because the most basic thing is that no one even fucking cares. No one even starts to fucking care. What about me, though? I have opinions. I have shit to say. Where do I say that stuff? Where do I accumulate the thing I want to say? Show me! Point a fucking finger! But they, no one even knows, bro. No one even bothers to know that I want to say something. You know? I can harvest comments in, in YouTube as, as many years as, as I want. And no one's gonna do shit. Because everyone is in the same fucking mentality. Everyone is docile now. It's like, well, it's, that's, the, that's gonna be the outcome, my friend. He has all the power. And it's like, what the fuck is this shit? What kind of power creep is that? But it's, it's the, it's the, you know, it's the YouTuber that has all the power to just block you, guys. YouTuber decides if you, you if you can talk or not. A YouTuber, guys. A person with self-interest for their own channel. All right. When people laughed at, like, YouTube heroes as an idea. But we have YouTube heroes. It's every single fucking channel for it, for itself. Those are the heroes, man. They have to defend their own channels. They have to build their own castles and defend it. I guess that's cool. I'll just have to learn the metagame, am I right? Oh, wait, it's not fun, though. I can't build a castle if I don't have bricks, man doesn't automatically flow into my system. I have to fucking suck dicks to get that shit. Three stars. It's absolute trash game. See, the biggest problem, if you have a community, if you have one game that you guys are playing as a society, collectively just like, oh, I like this one game. What has to happen is everyone must to be heard. Everyone will have concerns. Where do you will fucking send those concerns to? Where do you complain? You know? That's what has to happen. Everyone must be able to communicate in the fucking community. And if that doesn't happen, go play something else! Go fuck out of here! For fuck's sake! If you don't have a voice, go away! This game is not for you! It's gonna silence you and fucking bury you alive with fucking garbage! Like this! Like the shit that I'm playing against! I'm not having any fun, bro! I just want to fucking not n let you guys know that! And also, this video is sponsored by my suffering mother who has to fucking hear me fucking screaming shit and doesn't understand what the fuck is going on. Well, I'm silenced. That's why I'm screaming. Hopefully that helps, you know? For the future, not right now. Everyone's going to be like, "Oh, you I don't I don't want to watch this." What the fuck you don't want to watch this, bro? But you still want to play Hearthstone, right? You still want to know what's going on. 
in Hearthstone because you're so familiar with it, right? You're now in a community, my friend. And things gonna not work the same way as they did as when you licked Hearthstone's butt. Alright? There was a time and place for licking a butt for Hearthstone developers. That time is up, bro! The only thing the only thing you have is some fucking lunatic raw run making everyday videos, high production and stuff. Obviously he has a, his own editor, and once when he leaves Hearthstone. Because he, he, he talks about, uh, you know, other people leaving Hearthstone. He's just looking for his own reason to leave. When he, you know, becomes uh, ulti ultimately pow powerful and popular. He's just gonna leave. The moment Marvel Snap showed up, he's like, Oh, I'm gonna squeeze in, like, 40% of my content gonna be about Marvel Snap. Out of nowhere, no explanation, nothing. It's just Marvel Snap. And it wasn't even that good of a content. I didn't know, knew what the fuck was going on. The transition sucked balls. So he came back. Like, this, you, you can't fucking joke around with this shit. We're too mature now. But that's why you just leave. You just leave Hearthstone alone, and they will fucking understand that their game is not fucking fun anymore just because they printed more cards. That's not how it works. Oh no, not my 5-5. Five five. What am I gonna do without my 5-5 five five, though? Yeah, I do have three cards, so I didn't get my dragon, unfortunately. But I do have my win condition. And if he doesn't clear the board, he loses. That's it. That's all you have to do. You just have to know that you have to clear the board or you lose. Will he figure it out, guys? Will he find out? After the f the effect or right now, right? Will he clear the board? Oh, oh, he doesn't know, guys. He doesn't know there's a threat. Only pro players know, guys, that they have to have 20 board clears. Or they lose. You just lose, bro. What are you gonna do now, Mr. Totem Shaman? I didn't even notice. I didn't even knew until he played this card that he was a Totem Shaman. Oh, he was a meme. With, without an E. Meme. Well, that, that was fun. He's still trying to do something, so... Congratulations. Only a sad person would do that. No wonder I can't build a community. There's so many sad people. Oh, they g he gets taunts to make things even sadder than they already are. Get out of here, bro. Get smashed by 69. Three stars. Bonus star for clearing taunt minions? Nah, bro. Not gonna happen. He, he put no resistance. He didn't knew that you have to have five Borklers in your deck or you lose? Wow! What a loser! Obviously, if you play against Druid, you just automatically win. If you know uh, the trick called... Uh, they don't have Borklers. And it's the greatest trick of all time. So I win against every Druid matchup while being a Druid. Because I can exploit that to oblivion. Hey guys, it's, it's that chess guy, the Magnus. I'm sorry this is taking so long that I have to do double evaluation, but this is clearly like wrong, right? Clearly some bullshit happened, and I uh, got carried away. I'll still bump down this evaluation... ...a little bit... ...once it's done cooking. But then, uh, you get... ...some idea- this video is not for fucking new players. I'm sorry, bro. And there, I don't think there's too many new players happening anymore. If there's no influx of new players and the, the game is not refreshing, uh, it doesn't matter how many new cards you print. Un unless you're discovering some crazy new mechanics. 
are uh, actually using Tavern Brawl for what it's meant to be, which is explore and uh, create a new game mode. Or at least keep keep uh, an eternal Tavern Brawl. One of the best Tavern bra Brawls you can keep. That doesn't happen. It's like the easiest thing to do. Just keep one of them that doesn't suck. And then people will learn how to play that. And when it becomes boring and figured out, when the metagame uh, is solved, you just switch it to a new Tavern Brawl. Big fucking deal. And feel free to ban cards as well. But they haven't even learned that basic thing. That makes Tavern Brawls just garbage by default. There is still a big question, should I silence now or should I just uh, suck it up? I want to suck it up. I would love to. It's very hard though. Because, uh, well, he already played this Komal. It's just so stupid, though. You know what the coolest thing is? Uh, there's weapon removal, right? That That's it? Weapon removal? That's the only way I can interact with weapons besides taunts and weapon removals? It's the only way? That's so cool. At least the, the buff I can actually silence, and he didn't even play that many minions. Because he's clearly a fucking idiot. It's like, just max. Like, I can't clear the board, bro. Don't worry about that part. I'm not sure if, uh... I don't think Paladins have Borklers, but they do have this nonsense that's gonna happen. He's actually trading. What a champ. Your client is what? I'm angry, by the way. Hi, I'm angry. What is your name? Do I armor up with this? Because this is so weird. It's going to get soaked up by this stupid... Divine Shield. I get a pretty decent hero power. So armor helps. No, we, we didn't get to trade so far. We might with this. Oh, so stupid, bro. Well, I ran out of silence, this case. Let's see if we get some something done. Half a point. One and a half. Breaking the divine shield is a pretty big deal. So that's two points, but that's not enough. I wish I could break through, but I can't. It's still... Something. Remember this day, for your grace made my okay, whatever. Draw three free cards, as big as you want. As they say. Because you're pure paladin. You restricted yourself. In the most fascinating way of only playing good cards. You know, it's a, it's a very interesting restriction being a, a pure class. We almost call it racism or uh, white supremacy. No shame in that, though. That's how it should be called, white supremacy. If you... it's It should be a keyword in Hearthstone. 
a race supremacy overall so people fucking get an get a proper idea of what i'm talking about race supreme and they they learn a, an actual thing and that people talk about in real life i would very appreciate that now what would happen if i get a lot of power and a lot of reach what would happen i would leave i would not talk about hearthstone that much i would just do my little fucking tavern brawl i would just hide I don't want to be seen by many people, because I know how fucking frustrating that is to hear an opinion, and then there's more opinions and an infinite amount of opinions. Fuck that shit, bro. I'm not here to fight an opinion war. I'm just here to initiate it. Then, uh, you know. If too many people just want to hear my opinion, that, that's, I think, that's, that was not the point communities can't really exist stably right i don't know i've i've never found one to begin with like it would be a goddamn miracle so let's uh let's scourge the shit out of them right and we we, we can only win with borklers though we can start with frostmorn Hmm, so which way do we do? Let's let's do the Scourge way. Sounds about right. Just an, it's so stupid. It's like, well, you can play less cards and you get a bonus for that. Less cards? Back in a day like when when you had to play Reno, we had to play more cards. And then we get a bonus. More variety of cards. Now we play less cards and we get a bonus. Like that. Are you fucking stupid? Are you insane? Because they will have to force a very good bonus for playing less cards. Because they, it has to be powerful. Now it just has to be powerful. What is the point? Pure Palin is the stupidest thing I've ever seen. And I've seen it way too for way too long now. Like, what the fuck is that? Like no one wants to play neutrals anyways. You just gave an incentive to not do that anymore. Play less cards, think less, guys. Smooth brain more. Welcome to Tavern Brawl, by the way. Fucking hell, bro. We, did we won? We did not win, by the way. So I can easily do this. I, can, I will click. 112. So, uh, Stop me then. I'm gonna just come, just gonna combine some like this, divide by two, that's gonna be our evaluation, because I'm pissed. Uh, Dr. Seven, main. And it goes down by 0 0.4. Congratulations. Alright, we, we're not gonna have corpses for now. We'll probably start with giant, right? It's so dumb. And if I'm mistaken how this time brawl works, man, I'm gonna be very pissed. Show me your 10 10. I love when minions become immune, right? Like, that's, that's one of the coolest features in the game like immune minions like uh onyxia brood mother onyxia whatever Some... that one that one was immune when attacking so gets extra points of tempo basically a temporal divine shield fantastic and then neptulon like I mean, the Nixia worked so very well. Everyone loved the card. It was a 10 mana card that did crazy fucking things. And it just destroyed my life. And now we just. Oh, I have Neptulon now for you guys. You loved it so much. Who do you ask? Who, t who told you that? Oh, play 10 mana card and clear the board and establish your own board. 
my favorite thing to do. Just flip the board for free. 24 points of tempo out of a 10 mana card. Is that how 10 mana cards are supposed to work? What the fuck is happening, man? But you committed to into playing a 10 mana card, though. Yeah, because I need card draw. Duh. Uh. If I only get card draw and my cards wouldn't suck and 10 mana... Like, to force people to play a 10 mana card, it's, it's kind of weird. I understand it's kind of interesting. But it's also really weird. And I hate that shit, man. What is that? So he just ran out of cards? Already? So I, I haven't made my mind up about 9, 10 mana cards, like big ass cards that do crazy things. How do you have Neptulon? I don't have Neptulon, by the way. I just don't have it. So basically this Tavern Brawl sucks, and we can leave, guys. No Tavern Brawl this time. Unless you have Neptulon in your opening hand. <laughs> Hi! <laughs> Wasn't that cool. What else do we have? Because we can play some neutrals. There's a counter to Neptulon called... A thing. I mean anything that deals damage, basically. Just kind of a counter. Insatiable Devourer, I love that card. Because it's so fucking broken. Do we play the Dreamer? I don't know if it's worth it. You just play some... Like, this is such a brain-dead fucking brawl. My god. It's so bad. It's like, oh, I'll just play 10 mana at the cards, bro. That's all you can do. Where's the 8 drop? Is it gone now? I guess. My life, man. So there's no way to actually counter the stupid Neptulon nonsense. I'll play the Drake because, like, it's actually possible even with zero, zero cost card to actually get a finale. But, like, it's so difficult. It's probably not worth it. Choose an enemy. I, I don't remember how it works. I believe it, like, sticks around. Also, this gains stats. It shouldn't be, like, a horrible brawl. I should definitely keep these guys... Uh, the weapon is useless, I think. Oh shit, I only have one of these. Fuck it, if I can play Dr. Boom, I'll do that. I will do that, guys. Thaddeus is like the stupidest card! Who fucking thought of this idea? Who thought of this idea, man? Such a vomit! Oh, mana cheating into infinity. Do you like that? You like that eight mana card that Druid had that where you start mana cheating and stuff? Do you like that? Now we have neutral card like that. So you like that, right? Okay. Okay. Okay, I guess, I guess you know what you're talking about. Let's uh, start evaluations. I don't want weird stuff in Hearthstone, but that's what they need to make the game, like, fresh and stuff. Like, it has to constantly be weird, and no one has to f actually figure out how to play it, or how to complain about it. Because it's like, well, fuck you, fuck you, bro, look at all these weird things we can do, though. Stop complaining. I can do these weird things, though. You can always play around Borglers by fearing them or something. I don't know. 
I've never figured out. I'm I'm supposed to be the guy that knows how to play around Borklers, guys. I still haven't figured that out yet. I still haven't stopped complaining. <sighs> well, I, it's not a 40 points of tempo, but it's definitely 30. All right. You, you want me to calculate? 25. In other words, 30 because this is going to give me Thaddeus. All right. So if you were curious where there was 30 or not we don't know yet how thaddeus how big th of a thaddeus this card is oh no not the firelands portal and rope what am i gonna do now how am i gonna win where did you get that one you just played 10 mana cards bro don't worry about it don't worry about the small ones this is actually like exaggerates the problem that I was talking about. It's like there's no reason to play anything else anymore. Don't worry about it. Your 10 mana card is free now. You would lose card draw if you play anything else. So don't do that, my friend. There's no synergy needed or required. Maybe you might want to buff your entire board or something. I'm not going to do that because I can't. The end of story, guys. We figured it out. How to play this game mode, guys. Two stars. That was pathetic. I actually want to play uh, one of these. The Sunwell. Should be kind of fascinating. Like, I need cards. Just in case I want to have fun and stuff. But that's about it. Everything else can go away. Technically, this is a broken card. Because the only undead I will have, like, are going to be pretty giant. And this guy. Okay. Well, we just have to replace it. It's the easiest decision of my life, to be honest. Oh, and you got to love the, the attitude that Traron has. Let's put him in here. We summon him. He doesn't like when people emote. Oh no, I'm an influencer. I'm scared of emote, guys. Let's play this guy. Oh, I can play this as well at the same time! My favorite card now. Wow! It allows me to do so many things, even discounts my coin. Go away? You don't understand. We only just started. Oh, it changes polarity all the time. So right now, uh, Flesh Behemoth is uh, a good card and stuff. It used to be a bad card, but now it's good. And stuff. And so, uh, we also play this. Because it's free. I hope he's having fun, by the way. Because he's, uh, he's definitely waiting for something to happen. So he clearly doesn't understand what the fuck is going on. It's the only thing you can say to me. It's like, well, people don't share your sentiment. But give me a fucking voice and test... Whether that's true or not, if I am silenced, of course no one is gonna share my sentiment because they don't have enough brain to come up with those ideas that I have. They have never heard that before. Only on TikTok, guys. Only available on TikTok. Ideas? Not on YouTube, but on TikTok instead. So, what the fuck was that? Who did that? Who made my cards one mana? All of them. Like, regardless of polarity, bro. I didn't ask for this shit. Son of a... Son of a polarity. How... I... 
I don't know what happened, guys. That doesn't make sense to me. I cannot explain. Because, like... That's weird, man. Is it, like, minimum of one mana or something? I don't get it. I hope you guys had fun. I mean, I'm playing a very good deck. Clearly. Can't wait to see Raran's rendition of this cancer that we're, gonna, we're doing. Technically, we could do, like, an RPG episode, but I'm, like, tired right now. Clearly don't want to do shit anymore. I'm clearly not going to invest effort into this. L regardless how cool Tavern Brawl is. Anger is not supposed to leak. I'm showing a bad example. But I, I'm tired, alright? Maybe I exaggerated some points. But that's how I feel. He's still there. That he is! Oh, I have this thing. Whatever this is. I don't even have enough corpses. For this nonsense. I don't know. I don't know how to feel about all this. I could check some six drops, by the way. That should be interesting. They don't require corpses. I, you gotta appreciate how how much people love silencing. You have no idea how fucking they're they're salivating over this fucking idea all the time. But they're not not knowing the the wave of people that are waiting to just tear these assholes apart, just tear them apart, as if they never even existed. There's a wave of people right now waiting. You have no idea how many of them there are, and how upset they are. Like, I'm on, I'm on top of the food chain, under, but I'm not the fucking violent one, you know? I'm not a big ass... Uh, big ass asshole about it. Alright, I just, I just learned how to scream. That's it. There's some people who fucking would do anything. Bro. Because he don't care about anything more than fucking getting attention from women, for example. You know, getting some sort of recognition for the things that they have done in their life. Basic things. Basic things, bro. Nah, bro, let's fucking silence. Yeah, there's no nothing bad is gonna happen to these people, right? I'm sure. I'm sure I'm the stupid one over here. So the problem is we're gonna have to grab E Whelp. I'm not gonna sack. Makes no sense. Let's uh, taunt myself up because we might not uh, survive. If we don't, but technically have a perfectly good, well, heal. An insect destroyer. So if uh, three creatures die, we get to uh, sati sa satiate ourselves. We have to play around this card as well, so we... Oh my god, I fucking hate... This is so stupid. Yeah, 
Get out of my face, bro. Your only hope is gone. Now it's I either have lethal or I'm just gonna heal back up again. Or he's gonna draw the exa same exact card. It's very unlikely though. Or that can happen? What the fuck is this? Alright, your hopes are gone now. Thank you very, very much for watching. That is four stars though, I'm not gonna lie. He put me in some terrible position. If he survives this, this turn specifically, five stars. You fight well, my friend. Oh, lol. LOL! Oops. One, two, three, four. Oh my god. I almost forgot what I was talking about, bro. So is that exhausting. We could look for some, like, buffs and stuff. Ooh. Set your maximum mana, that's... Hmm. I wanna just look through and see if there's actually anything useful. But we probably should go from... From bad... From uh, big to small instead. Huh, I don't see... I... I want to play this card just because I have it. And it seems cool, right? It seems like hard to remove. The problem is, like, I do want, like, small cards at this point. Like, these taunts are pretty good. But then everything else requires corpses. As well, you know, like. So what about like uh three mana and up? We're gonna go. I could do this. I mean if I can play anything fun I will try. That's funny. That could block some shit. I guess that's cute. What else do we have? The Scar Legendary could be useful. Honestly, we could just poison, right? <laughs> poison sounds about right. Big Game Hunter. Absolutely. Seems better. Taunting myself up, like, super cool. Maybe even better than Tomb, Tomb Guardians. Like, I'm, I won't have corpses in this, in this mode. Technically, blocking like minions is uh, top notch. Idea. Let's uh, let's do that. So yeah, I I was talking about silencing. Anytime you watch this video this far. Anytime you see someone silencing, you know what to do. You resent that as much as possible. You try and uh, defend or attack that person. Uh, the defend uh, whoever is getting silenced. Or just straight up attack. That you, You're not comfortable with silencing. Everyone has to find their place and they, they want to do their thing and they want to... Uh, get their effort matched by the people who are lower level than them. You know. That's it. That's all I want. This is the most basic uh, functionality of, like, social media ever. I make a post. People match my effort. Uh, everything's completed. Obviously, we need to evolve social media and we need to find a way to actually make that happen. Make this, this principle uh, exist. 
it's tough work. I put in a lot of work. I've learned a lot of things. That are not uh, editing skills or some bullshit, you know. That uh, children learn after school. After finishing school. Oh, let me just look pretty and stuff. Alright, alright. Don't worry. Getting old is, is going to hurt you a lot. But don't worry about it. You'll take a bag and leave, right? You will not be influential. You, you never wanted to be influential in the first place, right? You just wanted the bag. The bag of shit. Because everything's getting more expensive anyways. So what's the point? You have to find a constant workplace. Otherwise you're screwed in the current way the world works. It's just weird, though. It's weird. <laughs> At least you won't be happy. You might, like, live a decent life. You won't be happy. Unless you le start learning principles at the same time. I don't see... I mean, YouTubers are, are smart people. Within their bubble. I don't know what happens when you pop the bubble. Or you make them go touch grass and stuff. I know... It, uh, grass deals a lot of damage to me, but just is is my personal problem, which I have solved by creating grass over here that I can touch and stuff. And it does not deal damage to me. It actually makes me feel very good. Anytime I can bring it up in in a conversation, that I successfully touch grass as a human being. I successfully touch grass. I sh I could have probably. Smashed into this shit. I, I screwed myself over for sure. Somehow I was desperate to heal. It would have summoned a random creature though. And I can still do it. And I can still burp 20 times. It's so stupid. What is happening? Well, what is happening? I'm, I ate fish. I mean, that's, uh, that's what's happening. I'm sorry, guys. Not fast food or anything. I can't afford that. But fish. Buy and die. Too bad I can't play anything, but no one asked. Let's see what else he has. Well, my... Th Why is he uh, not doing anything, right? If he plays one of these, I lose. Insta lose. I got nothing. I don't think that... Wait, that does work. Fuck my life, man. 16 damage for free. Just like, what the fuck? You gotta be shitting me, man. Ah, oh, steal my shit as well. Go away, bro. Just looking at my hand and salivating over that. Anytime Neptulon is split, I have to concede. I know it cost just 200, 2,000 gold and stuff back in the day. And I actually didn't bought it for some reason. I don't know. It just happened like that. It's just weird, like, all of them just have it, though. All of them are old players. Dedicated to this game. Dedicated in building and maintaining a community, as they say. No, dedicated to be a fucking idiot. For the most part. Did I meet friends, guys? That's that's the basic form of society. You can make friends. Alright? Shouldn't be that difficult, right? If we don't have a community, do we at least have a society where we make friends and stuff? No? The fuck the fuck we're doing then? Like if everyone is better 
and upset about the game? What the fuck are we doing about it? What, what? If we're not building a community of just people who play against each other when things go haywire... I mean... How are you gonna chill? You're just gonna leave the game. And the game is gonna die. But that's just uh, me and my knowledge of stuff. What the fuck are you playing this for? What is happening? It's useless, though. Eat it! Boom! Have fun with this. I'm sure you have enough spell damage and armor to defend yourself. So no big deal, right? F for the first time in forever, we got... A fueled golem. That's kind of like big enough to make some sense. And it did not make any sense. It just disappeared. I love it. Disappeared without any interactions or trace of existence. You don't even get, like, armor for this shit. It's that stupid. I'm bored. I don't know about you, but I'm bored. My rent was more interesting than whatever the fuck this is. This is garbage. It's not like you get to summon a bunch of creatures on the board with the mana that you spend. Nah, bro. Nah! It's the best way to actually nerf big creatures. They have to, like, vomit themselves onto the board. Except the, the you know... The ones that did... With the appendages and stuff. The colossal minions. They're like ridiculously powerful. What the fuck? Ridiculously powerful. One of the most powerful creatures ever printed. Fucking colossals. Some of them do require significant board space, but most of them just need three slots. Two slots. Nothing, basically. Fucking crazy nonsense. What the fuck, man? Well, hopefully you don't have any minions in your hand, bro. Oh, you did! Oh, I'm sorry about that. The fuck is that? He duped me again. We killed two creatures. But most of these are technically tokens from one card. It's way below average. There's nothing interesting about this. Please, please don't fuck with me, bro. Don't do that one, alright? Thank you, Jesus. And now we win. We just wait and win, guys. It's not that difficult. <sighs> oh, yes, cast the spell against me, please. Please, big boy. We could, like, require some uh, card draw ourselves. I'm not exactly sure how to achieve that. Probably the five mana dude. Draw three and stuff. The easiest one. It is quite surprising how Blizzard is willing to create all these ten drops. They're willing to do that. But card draw? Nah, bro. We forgot to print card draw. That one's too complicated to to print. We often forget to uh, give card draw. I will look for at least like three major card draw cards every single expansion. 
is good. I will have requirements for expansions at this point. Might as well start here. Expansion requirement. Three card draws. Three neutral card draws. For fuck's sake, man. Three neutral card draws. I don't get that, I complain immediately. That kind of sucks, man. Do we need to protect something? Not really, I don't care. It just sucks. I will lose, like, one of them. I need to taunt up whatever I get. Now we just stop deck wars. So I do actually need card draw. So I don't get into this position where it's awkward. I want to crush opponents as fast as possible. Once you figure out the basics, you, you have to figure out the speed. And that one's a lot more difficult. But that's the fun of it. You do difficult things as best as you can. That's how you acquire skills, guys. Once I be able to do overlays with my application, it will be so much easier to do evaluations clearly. I, don't, I just don't know if it's possible to like remove a background and start overlaying. Like, that seems very complicated. I don't know if Unity can handle that much pressure, bro. Because it also, also always has to stay on top and all these weird functions. I didn't like to concede. One, two, three, four. So let's find some card draw. I think it's appropriate to not focus on trying to counter my opponent because there's nothing to counter let's just draw some cards let's see how many card draws they printed out in at festival two card draws two not three two and one of them is a weapon so it's it's half of a card draw just half most of the time it's useless right so they did not print enough card draw they should have more and more card draw in the base set i don't know but you tell me i think it's a sin i think it's fucking stupid this is one of the coolest cards ever because it's a card draw it's so rare to have ability to draw cards these days it's ridiculous So, uh, Big Game Hunter can go now. I still want to know if Creepy Painting can work. Draw a weapon. Oh, we, we have some of that as well. Oh, fuck you, Creepy Painting. I want to win as fast as possible. That's about it. That's the deck. That's the final version, I believe. The thing that redeems this town brawl makes me happier is that I will win most of the time. Because I know what the fuck I'm doing. Oh, he has card draw. And his hero power, bro. Yes, yes, you have your only way and stuff. You're smart, bro. I'll keep all the card draw. Good, good enough. Technically, technically there is one more card that I forgot to mention. The Pyrotechnician. That's that's why I liked it so much. It just generates cards into your hand, bro. This is playable. It makes sense to play that, yeah. But then it's like, what the fuck are you doing with the Warlock class? Why do you need more cards? You can just stack. Just, just that, bro. It's not a big deal. 
Is he gonna return me to my hand? Is he gonna return this to his hand? Because he gets it for free. Now he gets infinite amount of cards. I'm sure that's very appealing. Oh, fuck my life, I guess. Is he gonna sack? Why am I asking stupid questions? I don't even care. I should have conceded the moment I saw that he's gonna get more cards because it takes him forever to figure out what to play. And which one do I play? Doesn't matter, bro. No one asked. No one asked you to know. Yes, I will. Yes, I will be crushed. Napsalon is so fucking broken, bro. I can't believe it's not in every single person's deck these days. Like, why not add it? It's just a win condition. It clears the board. Like, well, what's the big deal? Why am I not seeing it in every single deck? What is a dead mana card? <laughs> And I ironically play the Soul Seeker. No, don't worry, I don't have Neptulon myself. The Seeker of Neptulons, guys. Just play Neptulon, you can clear both minions. What's the big deal? Guys, I need to play anti Neptulon tech. Look at this shit. That's what I gotta do. You gotta do what you gotta do, man. How else am I supposed to win? Get out of here, Dr. Poop. We're hunting down Neptulons here. This is technically Neptulon tech, right? They play this card because of this reason? I would be surprised. That is so weird to me. It's a- it's just a good card in the end. Technically, this is also playable. Let's do Ysera. Does Ysera clear the board properly against Neptulon? It deals like 5 damage, right? Alright, get the fuck out of here. Okay, well, I can have one of them. Let's do this. This is so good. Alright, more stuff. Did we win the game? No, he played Neptulon. That sucks. We got our juicer. Neptulon can't touch this bad boy. This is where we start. Yeah, if you draw this card, you win. Like, how do you- how do I lose? Tell me a story, how do I lose? I wanna hear it. Should be a good one. No, what am I gonna do now? He played a Worgen Infiltrator! He played a card, guys. Holy Jesus. Is he playing about- around my patchwork? I'm impressed, I'm not gonna lie. Is he literally just gonna keep it there? <laughs> that That is the idea. It's like, oh, I have to play on curve and play big minions. I had this idea. And it came out as a fart. Right? It's just... Oh, there's... There's more weird cards. Did he just click the button? And like, added 15 cards and then like, click the button? You know what butt I'm talking about. The button of... I don't know how to build a deck button. It's my favorite. It's like, bro, if you're playing a card, card game, maybe you want to acquire all the skills or just go, go, go away. Just go away. 
But I'm so familiar, I know exactly how to play a card game, guys. By copying and pasting something. Like, at, at some point you can dumb down a Hearthstone to some extreme level. But it's not, it's not a card game anymore. I'm sorry, bro. It just isn't. Oh, you don't have spells, what happened? How did you get that card? We we may never know, guys. <sighs> now that speed right there. <laughs> I would almost want to force force draw that seven seven bro. Oh, because because it was that easy, it's two stars. It was inevitable victory. You can't play Neptulon now, can you? Oh, fuck. Uh, it, it's still a pretty fucking crazy card. The Broodmother. It's pretty crazy. Fuck you, man. That's illegal. Let's get some corpses. Alright, you got you got yourself a, a problem, man. He's gonna try and fucking rag me. He's still gonna try and rag me. You can sense. What? You were willing to lose all of this? That's fine by me, bro. I could technically clear some of this stuff. Let's do it. I want to know what, what's up with the, what can I do at all? That into return, I... Shut the fuck up, asshole, no one asks your opinion. If I possess something or not. I possess your mom's boobs, man. I can touch them whenever I want. Fuck, I, I want to juice it up as well. I'm probably forced to play this. But just for a 7 drop. It's kind of lame. And I can play the Drake. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I can give to any minion though. I should have just given it. For fuck's sake, man. What the fuck is this shit? They have this. Shut the fuck up! Oh, look, I lost. Let's look at a losing perspective, I guess. He is gonna fight from. 14 health. I was just talking about him and how he needs to hear. Of the sound of not having a soul anymore. Or as much as he had before. But he doesn't seem to have a soul to begin with. Yes.
Shut the fuck up, you too, bro. Played one card. Fuck, that sucks. He can probably trade into that. But not this one. There's no way you win after I get my 7 drop down. Zero chance. And vice versa, I can't win against the opposite happening. And also I have... Like, devour. Oh my god, the burbs don't stop! But it, it was so cheap, the fish was cheap, man, what do I do? Alright, let's die, guys. Let's lose this game in a spectacular fashion. How long do I have to wait, though? Fucking hell. Oh, I don't have to wait the entire row. Let's go. Adds more to luck, basically, I believe. I lost. Oh no. It doesn't go green until I draw a card. <laughs> that would have been crazy, bro. Lottery that was not <sighs> on your side. There might be ways to improve, I don't know. I have to find it within other players' games. Oh, hey guys, we win again. How fascinating. I don't think I will need healing against another Death Knight. Oh, I don't even need to win. I just win with this way faster forty points of tempo Killed a 7-7. Seven, seven. This guy's gonna be scared now. And stuff. If only I could do cool things in this turn, you know, like obliterate my opponent. Too bad I'm too weak to do that right now. It's probably the fastest win I've gotten. Turn three, guys. Many interactions have been had. I will give three stars for how ridiculous this is. This doesn't stop me whatsoever. Whatsoever, bro. I just... I just don't win, you know? Wow, you delayed one turn! Congratulations! You are a winner! You are not the father! It doesn't even work with an empty hand! Oh shit, I'm so sorry about that. 
Let me draw some cards for myself. For my birthday party. Oh, look. Mmm, I have two dragon cards. I don't know, I would never do what he did and just go into wilds and stuff. This seems so dumb. I don't know how wild feels like necessarily. It could be a video. But I don't know if I want to find out. It just seems so weird. Like, how, how wild is not worse? How does it look like? It looks more balanced. Like, so much more balanced. I can't... I can't even comprehend how that... How that is even possible. I clicked one button and I'm already surprised. And also, Death Knight sucks balls. Thank you, Jesus. Oh my god. Maybe this guy's right. Maybe Wild is the only answer we have. Eat it, bro. Eat this as well. <laughs> More removals! Holy shit! Son of a... Son of a removal master. How many more removals do you have, my friend? He played two already. He has all of them, obviously. I guess let's count. Let's count, let's see, one more, guys. It sucks, uh... Like, polar. I don't know. I don't know. You should just scream odd even and stuff like that, bro. It should look different. Every removal imaginable. I love that. He actually just wins. Oh, he just glitched out into the Matrix. No big deal. I would struggle to win anyways, I guess. Fuck me. That's one strategy, I guess. Sounds fun. I don't think I have any removals, personally. That I could use. This is a thing I could do. Actually... For the first time in forever. Also, this is playable. This is playable, even. This gives me a an interesting idea, yeah, I guess. Also, just buffing your creatures plus one plus one is pretty... Pretty nasty. But I already have the defender. I don't need that shit. Alright. Maybe he's right. Maybe I don't need card draw that much. I wonder if there's like big card card draw. That would be a lot better. If the big cards draw me stuff. Besides the Sarah. Technically there is. And it's actually quite fun. Yeah, that's removal right there. And so, the big card I'm talking about... ...is the Malagos. I can draw so much shit with this. I think Golem can go now. Rest in pieces. I wonder if Jailer is just automatic win. It's just such a weird card, right? Like, I want to have it. I want to play with that shit. If you play, like, 
some lifesteal creatures like these, you can easily jail. Alright. Jailer it is. I mean, if you just play big creatures, they just trade very well after playing Jailers, so you can't really die whatsoever. And taking, like, one damage a turn, you, you just... You just get free trades forever, though. Jailer is no-brainer. Who on the right... What the fuck is happening, bro? How do you draw that? Two cards! What is happening? Renathal into this, into two cards. I cannot believe what the fuck I'm experiencing right now. This is hilarious. Into Sunwell. What is the other spell then? Why do you need Sunwell so early? I'm so confused. Alright, you chose to do that onto yourself. I hope you're proud of yourself. Also, your dick looks very small. Unfortunately. And so he got jailed. Nope. He did not got jailed. Maybe he did, though. Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know, that was weird. There was a wild wow moment, but the rest of the game is shit. Alright, we have Jailers, so I want to see what happens. I don't need removals. Or card draw, I think. We have to skip that part. And just go for Thaddeus and stuff. Thaddeus and friends, odd. Odd. I might still win with Jailer, though. I have Lifesteal. What the fuck is happening anymore? Even cost cards. I'm not copycatting this guy. He copycatted me. Shut the fuck up. I, I, I don't like this. This is stupid. This is balls. Why not attack? Are you fucking stupid? That's that one thing that helps you win the game, remember? I can't target anything. What can I do that actually does stuff? That sort of does stuff. Sort of. Not as much as I expected, to be honest. If I kill one undead... Wait, it doesn't... It should die still. Huh. I don't know. It's so stupid. If you just attacked, I would have lost. And give me a free win, I'll take that. No, that's the stupidest shit ever. It's definitely a wow moment, and it's so stupid. I, I almost had lethal, though. I'll take two stars, because it's a win, after all. Now we're talking. Now we're getting somewhere. But it's already uh, the end of the video, guys. What am I going to do? thing is, to take a look at Donk... 
the most telling things is is that we have a bunch of Hearthstone addicts, and it's like, what the fuck, man? Who are these people? I can't relate to these people, bro. And just spending money in general is like so, so fucking dumb. But at least these YouTubers don't get paid for our sp spending money, right? Well, there's no guarantee. There's no guarantee, guys. Even if it is that way, it's not gonna stay that way. Not paid actors, because there's not that many of them anyways. So, they get paid by YouTube. <laughs> I mean, I, I can trust Eddie to be a honest person, that's cool. I can't trust him to be overly upset about anything or not talk about one top 1000 legend players and stuff. No, guys. Mage is not worst because people are playing Naga Mage. All right, all of a sudden. Jesus Christ. Damn, he's trying to survive, guys. What an idiot! Can't wait to get... This for for free, guys. When you can actually play it, it's free. Buffs? I'm worried the meta may worsen. I don't think it's worsened, but it's kind of just stayed the same. And historically, the greatest buffs for decks is to nerf the outliers. Slight buff... Yeah, nerf uh, the stupid ass Blizzard developers for not knowing that. Even Zeddy knows. No, he, he's kind of like my level smartness on Hearthstone, despite playing way way more. But he's probably because it's he's old and he somewhat has leaky knowledge. Of just uh, how to overall look at stats and everything. Obviously, he loses sanity anytime he posts anything on Twitter. But that's okay, guys. It happens. They're in a tier of their... I don't want to watch people like this. I don't want them to fucking watch other people's Hearthstone videos. Just to see what the fucking meta game is like. This this is what we have employed, guys. And that douchebag Zeddy wants uh, to reach uh, sixty nine thousand subscribers because it's so meaningful, guys. It's so meaningful. Uh, nah, for for me, Hearthstone is going down, but I'm a big enough person where it's gonna go down with me. Not without me. I just, uh, you know, realized that it's very difficult for me to, like, appreciate Hearthstone just disappearing from my life. That's not gonna happen. It's not gonna happen, bro. I'm gonna drag it down. It's way more satisfying and entertaining. My face, please. My face needs to make some makeup. I love to, there's a scratch in here. I'm the insect. How dare you, bro? How dare you offend me? That's so evil, right? If he doesn't recognize that I'm the insect. I guess I wouldn't die, though. It's right, so there. This is a wow moment because it's so weird. He can't play many cards at all. He can look. I, I guess he can trade into that. Never mind. It's not wow. It's kind of lame. But he's not willing to. Now it's a wow moment. Absolutely. Everything just changed when I got hit in the face. That's usually the case. For most of my interactions. I don't know why I did that. I'm a fucking idiot now. Well, 
That was fun while it lasted, guys. All enemies? Minions. Let's see if he wins. Because this is really bad. Making this mistake. So bad. I should survive, but not really. I should be able to play these and survive. If I survive. But I will not survive. Shut the fuck up! I don't not don't ask for your stupid fucking emotes when you're winning. I didn't even have lethal, bro. Ah, <sighs> I guess I win. The games are fast, I'm not gonna lie. That is an upside that I I'm, I appreciate. Even when bullshit happens, it's just fast. That's how Hearthstone should work, you know? It should be a little bit faster. Because, uh, like, the developers are, like, desperate to, like, create some broken-ass cards. Like, you don't need that. You don't need to just focus on cards. The way the game works also matters. And Tavern Brawl highlights that fucking easily. Easily. They just have to open their eyes a little bit wider and stop focusing on standard all the time. It's crazy, bro. But I can't play like duels. I, I don't understand duels. It's a whole fucking new ecosystem that I, I don't I don't want to deal with. It's very difficult to invest. I barely like can touch arena. I have it in the in the pocket. It is hard to wrap your head around. Like, what do I play? There's so many options, guys. And so you choose to do nothing. Oh, it's just kind of startling to see a patch with this many changes. At least from what I'm seeing, I'd love to hear your guys' take on it. Oh yeah, you do. I've never seen a uh, him existing in in the comments and stuff. So I'm not really sure if that was true what he just said. I'd love to hear your take on it. Mm -hmm. No, no, no. You forgot to check Twitter, I think. Is, is something wrong with your Twitter? And you, you won't know until you fucking test it yourself, right? That's the fucking crazy part. This is why leaders work. They test things. He actually doubled stats and still lost miserably because Thaddeus is way stronger. One, two, three. I didn't struggle, to be honest. So. But it, these games are like super fast. You get the start. I don't really like star rating in this case, because if the games are too fast, like, well, they will just get three stars, but I don't want games to be too slow either, or too boring. Normally, it's the interactions is going to give the most points. I just can't really, like, capture the, the full spectrum of interactions, because, like, you can play a lot of cards and stuff. Yeah, you, you can have a lot of choices. Eventually, I'll, I'll master this whole system. I can't complain, you know. Before... Before I can still make changes to it. Before people pick it up. On mass scale, you know. It's the only good side of being in the shadows, is that... There's not, not enough scrutiny for or great responsibility on me but i would still be able to handle it. it's not that difficult it just pisses me off to wait in misery and despair not knowing what's gonna happen all right let's see if thaddeus can beat the, the scourge the epic battles man i mean thaddeus is gonna die now so the only thing it did it summoned a a pretty sized sized minion, but like that's it. It's not a big deal for me. 
So we just we just smash into it, right? We can just smash. Probably have to remove this hardcore style. Alright, worked out perfectly. Now we can play a real game. Definitely was interaction right there. That was that was a crazy turn on turn two. It's perfect. I actually don't hate this brawl. I probably need to like evaluate it properly now. Oh, hi, Neptulon. How's it going? How's your wife? How's your children? Do they taste... Good. Fascinating story. Too bad it has to end like this. Is that some armor thing? Fancy schmancy, bro. This is a four-star game already. There's a lot of shit going on. I can barely comprehend. Damn, he even killed that. That's crazy. Let's start with this. Just open this up, see what's up. It kind of sucks. What is the big card so I don't forget? There's no big cards. Alright, then it doesn't matter. I guess the explosive. No, 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 this, this is a big one. Let's hold on to that. Fucking, he's gonna get a pyroblast, just you wait. It's absolute nonsense. Pyro fart. Fuck this. Just to watch him win, fucking top deck. Alright, I still got that out of the way. But I have no good cards. Now it's five stars. And I'm pissed. I don't like where this is going, man. Get out of here. Get kidnapped. Get dicknapped. I should win. Do I have anything close? I have like plus three damage on top of that. What does that do? Enemy minions. What if I return this to my hand? What do I have? 15. I need a... Uh, eight? There's no, like, charge minions, nothing. Except for this thing that doesn't work. So, I got nothing, man. I got nothing. So fucking stupid if he wins.
Is that a draw? Nah, I win. Holy Jesus. One, two, three, four, five. We actually have a five star game. This is above average. I probably will make a second video about this. We have to leave.